This one, three harmony contribution produce what? Water. This one, three harmony produce? Wood. So, one is about what? Make money. This one is more a strategic thinker. Okay? That's why this one runs Pepsi. This one ran eBay. Different needs, right? Multinational with multiple brands. Pepsi owns at least a hundred different <coughs> brands. Okay? Now, is that a company where you need innovation? Yeah, do you need to innovate? So what do you need to do? What, what, what is the nature of the business? It's about growth, right? Buy, gobble, 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 do deal, do deal, do deal, gobble, 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 make bigger, make bigger, make bigger, make bigger, right? Okay, so, I mean, seriously, is the CEO's job to sit there and do product development? Sit there and decide should they sell, you know, I don't know, Hokkien Mee flavor chips? No. A CEO's decision is to what? Keep the company steady. Re you know, make sure the company grows, but do they need exponential growth? At their size, it's very difficult to achieve. Yeah. So what you want? Steady hand. Also, companies like Pepsi, right? How they grow is what? They acquire. It's all about acquisition, right? So in terms of acquisition, acquisition is actually a nuts and bolts process, right? You go in, you duty the company, you see the bottom line, you see whether the thing will blend with your revenue mixes or not, and you just decide buy or don't buy. Okay? Typically, that is how the acquisition for a company like Pepsi is. They are motivated by just, they just need to know Okay, we need to boost up beverages. Hmm, Pepsi losing market share to some tea brand or some kombucha or some something. Okay, let's just go and what? Gobble. Right? What do they do to get rid of competition? Buy it. So you got somebody who basically is very financially focused. Okay, is actually what you need in a CEO. Okay, and also she is quite a very, I mean, she's not the kind of CEO who you go for like transformation or leadership or that kind of thing. You're going into her because you want a steady hand, okay? Matt Whitman, on the other hand, became the CEO of eBay from Mattel, okay? Now, when she became the CEO of eBay, it was nothing. It was a nothing. And she was the one that grew it. She was the one that made them buy PayPal. And she was eventually the one that sold, uh, was it, they sold themselves to Skype or Skype bought them or something like that. I can't remember, Mao. there's some connection there between eBay and, and Skype. I can't quite remember what it is now, but she was the one that saw the company through its, trying to find its ground and decide what sort of company they should be and where is the business model, you know. Because when eBay first started, does anybody know the history of eBay? It was started out as an online marketplace to transact pets dispensers. You know what a pets dispenser is? It's this thing that the kids click and the sweets come out. Okay, and it was mainly for people who collected these different pets dispensers and they would just sell it on this auction marketplace. Okay, she was the one that turned it into... Today you say the word eBay, everybody knows what it is, right? Okay, so a quay water comes in. Is the business at that time a big tree or a bush? It's small or big that time when she became CEO. It's just a seed in the ground. Nobody really knows what it's going to be. So the quay what? Water the wood. Make the wood have many different possible revenue streams. Think about how to make the business from something, from nothing to something. Okay, now. She has been, for the last two years, the CEO of 
HP. Uh, that one really, that's the other way around. That one, the tree is dying. Okay? Hire one yeet, one queen to come in and see if she can what? Water and save the tree. Okay? Can she do it? Maybe. If there is anyone who can realign a business, regrow a business to something new to try, you know, alter it, it may be her. 